Hi guys, welcome to my channel. I just wanted to show you all the items that I got for uh, Halloween and fall. Uh, the first of these items are all these cute little pumpkins. And look how cute they are. They're very small. Uh, you see they fit in the palm of your hand. But I thought I'd make some kind of a cute little centerpiece decoration out of all of them. So I got all the ones they had. They had the uh, yellow and orange. Then they had the total orange. Then they had a green one. And this one is pretty much the same, but it's got like a crinkly print on it. Very cute. Then they had the white. And then they had this one, which was the only one like it. And it's made out of like some kind of... I don't know if you can really see that, but it is like pieces of, I don't know. I think it's fake pieces of material on here, but it's very cute, something different. Then I found these cute little um, turkeys. I'll get it out. I got two of those because I thought those could go in a couple of different places. Then they had these, and they have the little legs. Two little scarecrows, two different kinds, so I got one of each. And then they had this little hoot. So I'm going to try and come up with some kind of cute little centerpiece with those. I'm not sure exactly what yet. Then they had these maple leaves. And these are made out of almost like a plastic stringy material. So I'm thinking those will be cute for a craft idea that I have coming up. There's 14 in here for a dollar, which is a great deal. Then they had these cute little hangings, and they have like, this one says, Welcome Fall. They're actually made pretty good. Um, this is like cardboard with a piece of burlap, and then this is cards, uh, not cards, yeah, heavy-duty cardstock with some kind of a plastic lay over it. They had that one, Then they had the little acorn, and I'm going to give one set of these to my daughter. She likes to decorate for the holidays, and then they had a pumpkin. It says autumn greetings very cute all made pretty much the same way then they had this adorable one that says harvest give thanks falling leaves autumn gatherings happy fall y'all and pumpkin patch and this is actually made out of a, like a plywood kind of stuff pressed wood and then they had this one which is harvest blessing corn maze pumpkin pie apple cider hay rides and thanksgiving I like to hang these on the walls in the kitchen. They, my kitchen is kind of this greenish color, so they look cute in there. Then, for all the Halloween goodies. First up, rats. They have these big rats, and it squeaks. So, so cute. So I got two of those. I'm going to put those in some kind of a little display. And um, see what I can come up with with that. Then... They have this cool gelatin mode that is a skull. And I'm not sure. I think I could make an ice thing out of this and put a little food coloring in it to uh, put that in a big punch bowl, which would be cute. I could make this the top of a skull out of gelatin-like stuff, like a polymer, not polymer, but like a, a gel clay kind of stuff and make that the skull coming out of an actual skull. I could do lots of different things. I'll have to show you when I figure that all out. Then they had these. And these are just like little um, glow-in-the-dark rest-in-peace. And they had a skull. So I got one of each. Both very cute. I thought I'd take them outside. We have a big tree out there. I'll put, the, put them out there by the tree. Then they had the most adorable things. These are little witch hats, and they're like, you put them, they're like little headbands, and they even have a little thing that comes down around your face, kind of like the lady wore in um, Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice. These were all for a dollar. They came in purple. This one is the purple one, and they're a little bit squishy, but I think I can make them quite adorable. They also came in green. I think they had one other color, but... That didn't really go with my decor. Oh, there was orange. I didn't get an orange one. I just like the purple and green because I'm going to do which purple and green. Then I found a little bag of rats. I think I'm going to put these. I have some um, witch bottles. So I think I'm going to put these on top of some of the witch bottles or maybe something decorative in the bathroom. Who knows? Then I found some cute, 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 cute ribbon. It's the wide ribbon with trick-or-treat, Halloween, pumpkin, spooky, happy... Beware. Very cute with a little bit of glitter. 
And let's see, what else? Oh, they had this little hat, which I thought would be just a cute little decoration. And it's purple and black. And then these boxes, which I can't tell you how cute these are. And there are four of them. Um, this one says danger, high voltage. And then you open it up and inside it has Frank. And he's got little rats in there. So cute, so cute. Not sure exactly what I'm gonna do with these yet, but thinking probably like a little gift box of some sort to give gifts with. Um, how's the other one? Oh, here we go. This one is a little orange one that says welcome with cute little bats and a spider all over it. And when you open it, it has inside of it, it has a little witch with her cats and a little broom. She's adorable. Then I found a little ghost. He's made like the witch hat. It's a little witch hat, little ghost. And then there is a black cat and a pumpkin. If I can get him out of this stupid sack. A little pumpkin. And they're made out of this it's almost like a plastic wrap. You can kind of see how it wraps around the little, the little decoration. But they're cute. And then here is the cat. He's like a scary cat. Like rah. Then I found some more ribbon. I found this one in a uh, what is this stuff called? I used to call it Rick Rack, but chevron, and then. This nice, heavy burlap. And then there's two more of these little boxes. This one says, go away. And you open it up. And it is ghosts. Ghostesses. And then the last one is an outhouse. <laughs> and when you open it, it has a ghost. And he's telling ghost stories. You've got some little eyeballs, a rat over here. So cute. And there's even like some little eyes here. This looks like a hinge, but it's fake. It's just like some glittery paper. Then I found another roll of ribbon, craft ribbon, in this cute skeleton picture. Turn it the right way so you can actually see it. And it's it's pretty. It's very pretty. It doesn't have any glitter or anything, but it's wire ribbon. Love that. And I found these cute straws. They're paper straws, but they got little spiders on them, so I thought they would be cute and bugs for Halloween to give to the kids. Then, of course, I couldn't go through there without getting the napkins. So they had these cute napkins with a pumpkin and a crow. So I got two of those. And then they had this one that's scary with little spidery bugs. They look more like ticks to me. That one's a spider, but those look like ticks. Either way, they're scary. So very cute on that. Then they had these cute little bats. They're little clips. You can clip on things. I thought they might make a cute little hair dilly or I don't know. People want something. I'll find something cute to do with them. And then they had these butterflies. And I love butterflies. And they're black with silver. Very pretty. Then I hadn't seen these before. These are some little jiggly eyed. I don't know if you can see them moving. But the eyes actually move. I've got a pumpkin, a bat, a cat, Frankie, another pumpkin, and then this little hoop. And he got a funny hat on. He looks more like um, St. Patrick's Day than he does Halloween. But he's cute. Then they had these that are black, silver, white, and purple little ghosts. They also had little bats in the same color combination and little cats they're so cute now these have green on them i didn't notice that and gold but they're cute and let's see what else oh these i had to dig and find these in a box but these are a little skull and he's on a little 
pedestal. So I was thinking I would make one of those, uh, I don't know what they're called. You put the glass over them and you put different things inside of them for Halloween. I'm probably going to put him inside that. I think he would be cute for that. Then they also had, <laughs> this is so cute, though my daughter tells me he's not anatomically correct. But he's a skeleton bird and his little wings like go up. So you can see him from the back, his wings are up. And he's got tail feathers that are bone, which I don't know about that, but he's cute. And his little jaw moves. All righty. That is pretty much my Halloween haul, I do believe. Hope y'all enjoyed this. Oh, wait, I forgot this. This is my favorite thing. Giant spiders. I'm going to put these out and scare people with them. Or I might put them on top of an apothecary jar. They'd be cute for that. Or a candy dish. You could put them, like, glue them to the top of a candy dish, which would be also very, very cute. But that is it for my Dollar Tree haul this week. Uh, thank y'all for watching. And we will see you next time. Thank you.